me and Olivia are going to take you through four simple exercises to make sure that we're focusing on that, shaping your handstand so that when you get back to your gyms, it's all ready. Quick recap on the handstand. Quick handstand. Remember, we're looking for a good, strong shoulder position, not too open, not too closed. For the handstand, eyes within your hands, chest in, nice rounded back, squeeze bottoms and hips open. Okay? Let's get Size number one. We're going to do arch to dish using a small pillow or something to raise your arms and your legs, and we're going to press down into a nice dish position. Ready, Olivia? Mm -hmm. Five times. And one, two, keeping our legs nice and tight. Three, four, and then hold on the last one for five seconds. Hips open. One, two, three, four. Five. Exercise number two. We're going to find a platform like a sofa. We're going to put your feet on it, keep a nice pike position, but again, focus on our chest. Olivia, if you can demonstrate, put your feet on, hands on the floor. And we're just going to walk our hands in towards the sofa, nice chest in, stop for one second, and walk backwards again, two steps, nice chest in, and then back towards the sofa. We're going to do this five times. Two, and the back. Three, and forwards, squeeze your legs, and back, four, checking that chest is in every time, five, and then hold, look at your hands, good, squeeze, tight legs, look at your hands, and relax. Exercise number three, we're going to do a handstand against the wall, you're going to make sure you walk up to the wall, get your hips as close to the wall as you possibly can, chest in, try and get your chest away from the wall, and try and keep your nice straight line of you're practicing. Olivia, up we go. Okay, so if you can see here, we're going to try and squeeze our midsection as tight as we can to get our hips as close to the wall as we can. We're going to keep looking at our hands, keep our chest in, try and get our chest off the wall with our shoulders on the wall. And then once we've got this nice shape, maybe your mum's or your dad's can help you find that shape, we're going to stay there for 10 seconds. I think Olivia's done about 10 seconds now, so if you could come down. Okay, the fourth and final exercise is back on the floor and we're going to be looking at this tension for your midsection and pressing down the floor. So Olivia, if you could show me a nice tension bridge on your elbows, please. So again, we're looking for this nice rounded back, our eyes looking at our elbows, squeezing your bottoms, hips open, holding that shape for about 10 seconds. You can do this three times. If that's a little bit too easy, if we could do an extended one with our uh, armpits open a little bit more, shoulder angle open, Olivia, to make it a little bit more extended. Good. And if that's really too easy and you're really advanced, you can try it on your hands. Olivia, let's see if you can do it on your hands. Hands and feet. Nice and long. Nice long feet out as far as you can. Shoulders open. And stay there. See how low we can go, Olivia. Can you get as low as you can? and slide open and stop there in that position, hold for five seconds, look at, the, look at your hands, you can see it's nice around the shape. Okay guys, so there we have four exercises for trying to improve your handstand shape safely. Remember, ask your parents uh, permission before you kick it up against the wall, and the key is stay safe. Enjoy, work hard, and we'll see you soon. Thank you, Olivia.